Hi, I'm Solomon and I play ice hockey for Union. I'm going to show you around Varsity, but right now I need to get ready for the big game. I came to study economics and philosophy, but I fell in love with Varsity. There's over 15,000 students supporting, thousands of students competing, 18 different venues across the city. I'm going to show you what it's all about. Welcome to the sports park, let's go uni! So as you can see, it's black and gold everywhere. It's a really inclusive feel here. You haven't got to be a part of sport to actually be here and feel the energy for varsity. We are a community and we all come together for this games. Every team here is worth the exact same amount of points. Whether you're first or third, there's equal opportunity and equal importance. So have you guys got any tips for Varsity? Be loud, cheer the team on. Go to as many games as you can. Get involved, more like cheering. Be with your team, have fun. Varsity began in 1997 when two sports officers, one from Hallam and one from Uniov, came together to make a competition to see who comes out on top. How deep is the rivalry for you? Although there's a competitive element to it, really, it's all about the oath and promoting participation, making sure students are performing on as big a platform as possible. And how far do you think it's come? It's come so far. I mean, today we've got 78 different fixtures, 78 different points. I think 22, 23 years ago, there was only eight fixtures happening. So it's so great to see the progression that's been made. Yeah? All right, here we go. Do I look good, yeah? The athletes get to compete in some of the best facilities in Sheffield. It's not often that these athletes get to see amazing and big crowds like this, like today in the EIS. Um, you wasn't in sport before you came to Sheffield. Uh, how do you find it now and how did you get into sport? Um, so I actually find it quite easy. Um, everyone was really, really welcoming. The and what sport is it that you do? Cheerleading. Oh, right, um, okay. But the girls were lovely and um, they made me feel really comfortable when I was auditioning and stuff. So, um, and now I love it. Do you think that uh, sport at Sheffield has changed the university experience at all? Yeah, 100%. Like, joining a sports team at uni was like one of the best things I did. Um, the girls are on the team, I like my family now. Just get involved with any sport, even if you've never played it before, everyone's really welcoming. Go to one of the Give It Goes and just try it out. It just completely changed everything for me, gave me a lot more confidence. I ended up going for sports committee this year and I'm going to be the next sports officer next year. Oh, so. yeah. <laughs> Other than EIS, we have other world-class venues, things like the Arena, the Sports Park, Ponds Forge and Hillsborough Stadium. So we're here with Sophie Peace and she's just been subbed off after an amazing game. Um, Sophie, how's it feeling? Absolutely crazy, like the fans, it's so loud, like on that pitch we can literally hear every single chant and yeah. honestly it literally gets you right here. Are you and loving it, this? It literally spurs you on, it's great. I feel like more people should watch women's football because at the end of the day, like we love playing and we love it when we get like this sort of support yeah. as well. So. So there's not just sporting opportunities here at Sheffield, we've also got things like Forge TV, which cover all the media. Yeah. So, what do you guys even do here at Forge? Uh, so, we stream all of the varsity events. Most all right. Of them. Um, so, here at Hillsborough, we've got a little setup here, we've got our sound desk, the measurement. So, it's basically like a setup like any other broadcast would have. This is a pretty basically. serious yeah. setup, isn't it? Yeah. So, you can not hear the game, you can watch it at home. Oh, so I can stream this on my you computer? Can stream on YouTube. What is it? Oh, it's on YouTube. Television, yeah. All oh, right. Okay, so we're watching the bouldering at Climbing Works. So you've got the points, yeah? Yeah. So, so how does this work? So if you get to the top on your first go, then you get 10 points. Yep. And then the second go, you get 7 points. All right, I've never done this before. No problem. What do I need? Uh, climb, some climbing shoes. Have you got any? Yes. What size are you? Eight. Yes. <laughs> try those on. So my toes are supposed to be squished at the top? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's give this a try. 
We're really lucky here in Sheffield that we've got the national park on our doorstep. It holds the sports like equestrian, mountain biking and rowing. And the favourite part about Varsity for me is the finale. This is it, the big finale of Varsity. I hope you've enjoyed the tour. Wish me luck.